Hello everyone, I'm YouTube. and welcome back to Born of Bread. We're in the whale. The pin yeah, serious Pinocchio situation going on here, but it's fine. Alright. We're gonna continue down this path here. I hear some squiggling going on. If there's an enemy down there. I need a teleporter. Okay. The mound. Oh, a blizzard bow. A bow originally found inside the Shivery Caves and used by many heroes since. Stops enemies in their tracks. It's no wonder it's so popular. God damn it. <laughs> See how much space it takes. Okay, I might be able to fit that one in, actually. I could, like, maneuver some stuff around, but... Hmm. Honestly, I'm probably not going to use the little gear rang thing anymore. So let me go ahead and just use to get rid of that. Okay. Wait. Since when was the super ladle... Its own thing. That that that's not supposed to be there. I don't think it's supposed to be. Weird. Adds a dash of super to cul any culinary endeavor. In the hands of hero serves up some righteous just desserts. Weird. That's not supposed to be there. I have now two of them. I guess if I wanted it. <laughs> All right, anyway, um, let's see if I can squeeze anything else in here before we continue. I don't think so. I'll just put this in there. Uh, Alright. Okay. Oh wait, my... Did my ladle revert? Am I still... Is I super ladle? I'm so confused. Back. Hang it back up. Oh, no, no, oh no, it is. It is super little because that does two because it has one defense. Okay. Whew, I was like, scared for a second. Shish kebab. <laughs> Uh, let me uh, check my pallets real quick because I restarted the game because I, I took a break. So I'm pretty sure all the pallets are boned up for whatever reason. Oh, there's a save right here. Damn, I went back and saved. <laughs> Hello. Do not be afraid, fellow organics. Uh, that would be very biological. I understand your hesitation. My glutton flea associates consume everything in their path. I am not one of them. I have a discerning palate. I can analyze carbohydrates much more efficiently. This analysis gives me what you might call pleasure. Oh. However, I have analyzed every food sample found in this ecosystem. I require new data. It would bring me great joy if you were to bring me new samples. One from each ecosystem found in the Royal Kingdom. Any kind of food stuff, however, please do not bring me anything gold, since the metal interferes with my operating procedures. I repeat, any food, but nothing gold, please. Okay. Yeah, it's a jelly donut. Greetings, organic life forms. Do you intend for me to consume the organic of the Bivode family that you are leading around? Leading? <clears throat> How dare you? Take one thrust closer and you'll regret it. Understood. I detect new samples within your cloth compartment. You give one to me. Sure. Analyzing. Analysis complete. The adjectives say the best described this sample would be hearty and tasty. The flavorful components are prominent. Thank you for providing me with this. Okay. Uh, I have identified the organic of the Priocyanide family. Shall I consume it? I think it's talking about me. You can't eat me. I, I bet I taste awful. Understood. I detect new samples within your cloth compartment. Yep. I'll describe the sample as yummy and refreshing. It has an interesting sequence of nutrients. Thank you for providing me with this. Okay. I see you are accompanied by a chianophile. Is it intended for consumption? 
You can't eat me, you dumb tin can. Understood. I detect new samples within your cloth compartment. No. I categorize this sample as being comforting and delicious. These carbohydrates are pleasing. Thank you for providing me with this. There's only one more to do. Uh, this one? My glutton don't associate to consume everything in the path. I am not one of them. Okay. okay so we did one from third place. We did it from... We did one from third place? This one? There we go. I am curious. Is organic of the Draco Ignis family for consumption? This is me. I probably wouldn't taste very good. Understood. I detect new samples in the cloth compartment. Okay. I will qualify the sample as delectable and very tasty. I may lack nutrients, but it was an enjoyable experience. Thank you for providing me with this. What else is there? Who have I not pulled out yet? What's her name? Oh, sorry. You are saying stuff. It is warm, fuzzy, analyzing. Analysis complete. I have something analogous to heartburn. I will not include our creamy with the reward. Yay. Thank you. Okay. Good thing I have. I was hoarding my healing items so much. All right. Oh, I just found a heart. <laughs> the docking bay for the whale. Okay. Oh, it fell in the goo. Oh, there's a, uh, what I assume might be the boss of this area. Well, before we confront uh, Jester, I'm just gonna. I didn't fully explore this area yet. It's kind of hard to get around, but let me see if I can. Uh, is there, there's some stuff I want to get with what's her name. Let me just pull up the map real quick. That's right, I don't have the map yet, because barrels still in here somewhere. I haven't found them. Ugh, damn it. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, so let me explore up here, because I haven't really explored this. Oh, no, no, sorry, it's the other side. I think. Yeah, it was past the, the skill check. I believe? Or was it the area before that? Mm. Eh, just give me a second, I'll find something. <laughs> What's her name a little bit more? Yeah, Alfie. Our new companion. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Uh, she has a lot of AoE attacks. It's really nice. What was that, by the way? Some say Alfie's uptight, but she knows how to have a blast. She goes ballistic at her enemies with, while cannonballs drop on them. A high caliber move. Alfie follows a punishing blow from her guitar with a barrage of ember insults. The enemies don't understand the words, but the, remain, the meaning is clear. <laughs> yeah. yeah, this is the area I wanted to explore, actually. Here's, let me say what's up real quick. Yep. Okay. Excuse me, sir. Hey, hey.
It's level, actually. Yep. Nice. <laughs> bling, 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 bling. Steam. Okay. Oh. Doesn't need any help. He can just take out anybody by himself. He's just, they're just throwing single enemies at me the whole time. Professor Barrel, are you here somewhere? Let me explore this. Okay, I think this might be finally the, the door I was looking for. It leads back to that one area. Wait, the shortcut. It sounds like it, yeah. Yeah, it is. Okay. Sweet. Alright, I'm, I'm actually gonna go ahead and head back to the beginning and fully explore this area, because I think Barrel might be in some of the, the earlier areas. So now that I have the hook, I can pretty much get everything in this place. Because there was a couple hook areas in the beginning, so... Oh, wait, wait, I fell down the hole? Oh. Oh, there he is. Well, shit. Drawing this map has been quite the challenge, but I've taught all the rooms I could find. Here it is. And please don't hesitate to ask me about this strange place. Oh, here. I believe we're in the belly of the mythical creature, the primeval whale. Most experts, including myself, thought this creature to be fictitious, but here we are. Our uh, early historic records mention sightings of the whale, so we have no idea how old it is. Other than fishermen tales and ancestral texts, we have no concrete information available. But you can bet your buns I'm writing down everything I'm seeing. From my preliminary research, I believe the whole whale to be a self-sustained ecosystem. Fascinating. It appears to be a biological machine. But until I consult with the Rose and Brown, I'm not prepared to submit any of my theory for a peer review. Tread with caution, I imagine this creature holds many secrets. Tell me about the lagoon. Our lagoon, with its long sandy beaches and dazzling sunshine, would be a perfect vacation destination were it not for the plethora of dangerous, dangerous creatures. It has a long history of piracy, thievery, and naval conquests. Have you heard of the famous Numskull Island? As it has it that Captain Numskull shipwrecked on that island long ago and hid his treasure there, perhaps for a rainy day? The mistake he was made was that Numskull Island is the only significant island in the lagoon, so his treasure didn't last very long. The crows capitalized on the legend by building a themed village on the island. More fun than a vacation center. What? <laughs> moo! Da yeah, moo! Moo? Alright. <laughs> Good talk. <laughs> Oh, we're in the beginning, okay. Okay, now that I have the MMA app, I can see all the things. Let me pull up. Okay, so we got everything in the waste yard. The bio foundry, iron pools, cellular hive still has something, and that's it. Okay. I'm pretty much. I seem to find the cellular hive again. I think that was actually there. Uh, I can't go back now, though. I gotta walk all the way back. I thought there was more stuff that I missed, but maybe not. Maybe I'm just too good, and I cheated. <laughs> Can I get up there? Oh, wait. Excuse me. <laughs> Smoosh me! Smoosh, I say! Ow. You'll never get me. I'm too small for you. <laughs> Later, Gator. Okay, Yagi. <laughs> Don't freak out on me, man. Okay, that hole is what led over to Professor Barrel. I didn't even realize that was above. It doesn't make any sense. Okay. I really didn't miss much, actually. I'm actually pretty good about finding all the stuffs. 
Just gotta head back across the bridge, and we should be golden. Thankfully, they didn't raise again. There we go. Okay, so what are we looking for here? I think it's like one salamander, two chests. Is that correct? No, one salamander, one chest. And that's it. Okay. Got it. This didn't help me at all. I thought there was something up here. I guess not. Okay. I need money. Money, money, money. Goodness. Whoa. Hey, chest. Oh, it's another compromise. Oh my god. Stack compromises if I wanted to, but I don't know what to get rid of. Maybe, I mean, if anything, I guess maybe the, um... The cost reduction one. That's probably not too useful. That, no, no, that's, that's constant. Let me get rid of the timed one. Probably the best thing to get rid of. <laughs> More More damage. <laughs> Now the ladle will do four damage. <laughs> it's I lost sight of the pink. I lost sight of the pink electrical arc, but I think I might have found a secret way out. If I survive this, no more hero stuff. I'm done, Turner. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. Me. Okay, that's everything in the whale. Let's go back to the dock, I guess, and see what Jester's up to. <laughs> no, don't do- oh my god. It's just BS. Yes, I say. Okay. Let's see how much that super little does. Wait, that's, that's the same amount of damage. Do compromise not stack? Hmm. Nailed it. Still getting used to that. All right. Any more skill points? Yeah, yes. Probably one more. I can get a... Yeah, whatever this is. Okay, sweet. Okay. And if this is it, if this is it already, this is kind of a quick chapter. Oh, he nailed me. He led the shot. Already did three damage. Hmm. Yeah, sure. I'm not going to Queen. Use 
me. All right, let's go ahead and use a healing item. And I'm going to head over there. Uh, I think I'm missing a bunch of HP. Golden pair? Yeah, let's do that. Okay, I'm ready. Need to ever be, I guess. Oh. He's got the shard. jack has got the last piece. We're doomed! If he's got the last piece, why hasn't he put the whole stone stone back together already? Maybe he's about to. We should take him out fast. Sh shut your yaps. Let me talk to them. Jester, you don't have to do this now. It's okay if you're not sure. He's totally sure. He's just waiting for the right moment, right, boss? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do it. Don't rush me. Yeah, Alfie, don't rush him. You shut it, Sid, you dingus. Think about it, Jester. You have all the pieces now, so you can complete the mission any time, but maybe not yet, huh? What, you think I'm scared? I I'm not scared. Uh, of course you're not scared. We've done much scarier stuff, you and me, and, uh, Sid. Too right. We're the bravest of the brave. Yeah, we just need to push the pieces together and say some words. No, uh, I mean, we're so far underwater. You don't want to do it here. Huh? The Empire won't reappear in the wrong place, would it? Anything could happen. I mean, what do you really know about the spell your dad gave you, Jester? Uh, don't start that again. It's a spell that fixes everything. Uh, do you know how it works? Who cares? I promise I'd do it like I'd do this. Like if I was going to break a promise. You don't have to do what Emperor tells you anymore, Jester. Shut up! Get away from me or I'll do it right now! Yeah, come any closer and you have to go through me. Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> Just... <laughs> Corrupted hero. Oh, no. Grr, I knew it! Traitors! Conspiracy! Oh, shit. Jester! Stay back, you wretch. You punks. I've cut you over it ended. I knew it. You are rotten to the core. Oh, yeah, I am pure of heart. She's completely mad. I will cleanse the scourge. Yeah, so number one is the boss again. <laughs> oh, yeah, she's she's wild. She's iris twitching. <laughs> All right, let's, let's beef up. Oh, I'm good. Okay. I'm gonna do whisk it, whisk, because that that shit's pretty powerful. And it lowers your defense by a ton, so. Oh, and that is tearing them up. It's fine. It's not what I meant to do, but... Oh my god! She's crazy! <laughs> okay. Uh... Yeah, so you're to fire, huh? Should do it actually. And she's done. No, impossible. The righteous always triumph. Yeah, that's why you lost, evil old man. Grano, I'll tell everyone you sided with this. 
gum. I'll have your heads. Every little one you down. You attacked us, and Lope is a fellow guild member. Yeah, that's got to that's got to be against the rules. <laughs> Who would ever believe you over me? The greatest hero of all time. Um, I've already sent the battle footage to the guild. A battle footage. Oh, don't think you're about to lose your ranking number one. No longer one. No! No, I am number one! I am the greatest hero! Duh. Checking the updating bleeder boys. How else you're not even on them? Better kiss your hero permit goodbye. No! No! Ah! Oh, wait. Here she is. Number 73,411. 73,411. Doesn't even have the same ring to it, does it? Jester, wait. You don't have to do this. Maybe she's right, Jester. Something about this stinks. And it's not just all the gross fish stuff. Let's take the stone back to the others. Whatever we do, we should do it together. You too, Sid? I, I thought you were my friends, but I can't trust any of you. We are your, uh, we are your friends. We're just worried. No, stay back. If I can't trust any of you, I'll just do it all myself. I will keep my promise. Goodbye, Sid. Alfie, don't follow me. Jeez. Well, oh. Hmm. Everyone okay? Yeah, looks like we're back on Crow's Nest. Ah, uh, eaten, exploded, half drowned, and now covered in sand. I hate the beach. Uh, Sid, are you okay? I can't believe the boss left me behind. Me, and now what? I have to work with these dorks? Come on, Sid, I don't think I don't think the whole restore the Empire plan is a good idea either. Yeah, but that doesn't mean I didn't want to be included. Well, how about we make a new plan? It's called Stop Jester from doing something done to impress the day. <laughs> we had a whole lot of practice at that already. Yeah, like that time Jester tried to climb the palace walls because the Emperor said he shouldn't have been able to climb a mountain. Yeah, he <laughs> his leg took a month to heal. Okay, I'm in. Elfie, what's happened? Where's Jester? And why are you with this lot? Guys, Jester has the last piece of the sunstone. He left to go to do the spell. Nice, wait. Not nice. Ugh, my head hurts. No, we're not good, Klein. I'll get you guys up to speed. Oh, there really was a lady chasing you in the sewers, eh? So even Jester doesn't fully understand the spell. Huh? Jester said the undead soldier spell was based on the recipe that brought you to laugh? Your papa read it from a old book, eh? If we could find this good book, maybe we could find out how the spell works. I'll go. If I can't find it, I'll figure out what the Emperor changed. Maybe we can stop the spell before Jester finishes it. Oh, we know you know where he is. Send me, send me will find Jester. He's probably just back at the hideout, eh? Yeah, probably wondering where y'all went. We'll get him. Let's go see Papa Baker. For no reason. <laughs> of course, he might know. Oh, cool. So he might know where the book is. All right. Yes, and he has the best snacks. That reminds me, check out this cool fruit I found when I was uh, trying to trap you guys. It has a powerful aura. I was going to show it to Jester, but I think you should take a loaf. Primeval fruit. This has a musty, albeit sugary taste. It's an acquired taste, really. Thank you. Oh. Um. It won't take you too long. It's time for the fast charger. It better be. <laughs> Ooh. Loading? Please be loading and not crashing. There it goes. Okay. Oof. Um, are we working with your friends now, Alfie? Yeah, what happened to all the enemies for life stuff? Bring back the old empire? We, uh, kind of like it here. I mean, Clyde told us about the warrior tournament, Yag Yagi. And where everyone gets to test their strength, but no one dies. How'd you even know who won? Huh? Well, there, there's rules. Besides, if everyone died, how would anyone become a better warrior? Haha, <laughs> rules for fighting? That's hilarious. And Eo said people here have no clue about real magic. Oh? But she said... She also said that's not a bad thing. Magic can be really dangerous. She wants to find a way to do things better. It's been easier to be ourselves here. Back home, whatever we did was wrong. We were always in trouble. 
My parents were bards, you know. I wanted to be one too, but we were only allowed to sing about the empire, the wars, the glory. We got old fast. My mom had this awesome guitar. I can still see it. Crimson red with these gnarly hooks on each side. Uh, didn't we pass by something that back that was... Didn't we pass by something like that back at the lapsary? Oh yeah, oh my god. Oh, totally. The monks have hoarded treasures for centuries, so they could have found your mom's guitar. Y you think so? Man, we had some good time singing playing that guitar. Hey, I know I know time is time, but maybe, maybe if I can get back, it might be helping me remind Jester what really matters. Good friends and good music, that's what I'm fighting for. That whale has seen so much of history. I wonder if in a thousand years someone will be watching that screen and see us. Wait, do you think it's watching right now? It's okay if it is, we're just making s'mores. <laughs> oh man, hope I didn't see the time Kokoi beat me, bet me and I couldn't jump over the moon. What happened? I climbed on the roof and face planted into a dung heap out back. Oh yeah, it definitely saw that. <laughs> I understand why you guys are even I don't understand why you guys are even friends. Jester is so mean. He's not mean, he's a uh, uh, rebels. I mean Jester isn't usually like this, yeah. Sure he can be stubborn, but he's also fun and creative and full of ideas. And he never gives up, which is this case kind of a bad thing, I guess. Back home we started a band, Scion of Flames. We practiced in secret for months. Jester wanted to do a full flame salute for his dad's Ember's Jubilee. We weren't very good at first because all I was the only one who could play an instrument, but we got better. Now Klein is a great drummer. Eo plays the music of spheres and Sid does backup vocals. I miss that. Just jamming together. We never did tell dad about it, his dad about it. In the end, it was just for us, yeah? Well, I can't really sing, but I'll jam with you, Alfie. Okay, what instrument do you play? Uh, uh, I'll make one. I'll call it the Farnal Hoggle. <laughs> How do you play the Farngle Hoggle? Uh, that's a secret. <laughs> Those images we saw in the Empire were pretty messed up. Was it really like that? It wasn't that bad, sort of, mostly. Okay, it could be awful, but we had each other, you know? Uh, like one time, Klein accidentally smashed the palace window. We tried to fake break in so he wouldn't get sent back to Gladiator Arena. We put glass and footprints all the way to Jester's door, trying to make it look like the boss assassination attempt. In the case of a missing assassin. Yeah, only the Emperor saw right through it all. <laughs> glass was facing all the wrong way. So he threw us in the dungeons for a month. The dungeons? A month? Yeah, the hilarious part is Jester knew the secret way in and out. So we pretend to be all chained up, and then if no one's looking, we all sneak out together. That that sounds pretty bad. Maybe you had to be there. I'm just worried about Jester. He always wanted to make his dad proud, but he's never turned his back on me before. I, I just want my friend back. You guys don't think number one will come for me, do you? I mean, her hero license revoked, and she probably blames me for, you know, ruining her reputation. Yeah, she's probably scared of you. You got her with the old bureaucracy one, too. Hiya! <laughs> you didn't ruin anything, Dub. She did it herself. You just told a guild about it. Uh, but Sam's not supposed to talk. We just record what happens. I, I broke the rules. I think being a hero is about doing the right thing, not the rules thing. You saved my life, dude, and if that's against the rules, then the rules are dumb. Uh, thanks, guys. Alright. All right, sweet. That was a really short chapter, actually. So we did a whole bunch of crap in the last one. I think we're getting closer and closer to the conclusion of this game. Okay. Oh, all right. Hello, guys. I see it's been quite a bit. Professors, how'd you get back to Shoal? It was the strangest thing. We have no idea. Oh yes, one minute we'll look in the life cycle of the Commonwealth, Phil Barn Fed Barnacle, and Expo Whoosh. Right to shore, Dolly Lucky. Elders, Jester has got the Sunstone. He's going to destroy Royal Town. Oh my, that's terrible die indeed. A variable calamity. But things always look so much better after a cup of tea and a bicky, don't you think? Perhaps even a nice sit down, wouldn't you agree? Oh indubitably, old chaps, just what I was thinking. Where the hell am I? Okay, I don't know. So let's see here. What are we missing in this place? There's one more salamander somewhere. I actually know where it is, to the bottom right. Ugh. I 
I was actually kind of hoping that it was the, um, the crow guy that would be your last companion, but I guess that would be kind of random. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, yeah. Well, speaking of... Yar, is that me, crew? I signed for sore eyes and no mistake. I have a fine story to tell you. After the way you scuppered me and ship, I dreamt over ten days and ten nights across the endless blue. An hour at most. An hour at most. And just as I'd given up all hope, we washed ashore on a desert island. What's more, a sand we covered in a strange large rex excess. Convenient. Convenient. Yar, so I get to digging and what do you find? This riddle with treasure. Yo, yo ho ho. <laughs> So I buries it right back up again and draws a careful map, of which I have wee fragment right here. But why not just take the treasure with you? Are you mad, lassie? It's treasure. You can't just go around and unburying buried treasure. Besides, treasure runs out, but selling maps to treasure is just good as business. Rock, better gold tomorrow than silver today. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Yeah. Oh, come on. Oh, I did it. Okay. Fine, Mr. So. Oh, wait, this leads to a different area. I see early girl. Hold on, let's go ahead and do this. This one actually might lead somewhere. It's up here already. Let's head back to the frozen flats, but where? Loading. Loading? Hello? Oh. Oh, oh right, that gap. Oh my god, okay. Well then. Huh! Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright, let's go back, I guess. No point in going here. Damn, loading between these two areas is a tedious process. Okay. Oh, I nailed it. Shit. Okay. Okay, so I saw early girl, but I need to get this salamander here. Where? Oh, maybe it was... Maybe it was over here. He was right here the whole time. I could just got him. Blink. There you go. Okay. okay. Can I snag these items from the? Oh, is oh can. Got he. Sort of. I can't get the thing though. What the hell? <laughs> Oh, I can't, I can't snag that, though. Or not? Definitely lights up like I can. But I want my OJ! No! He thinks this, uh, ability isn't... ...functioning properly. Alright, whatever. Okay, this leads to Numbskull Island, which we haven't been here yet. This is a new area. Damn, these are long loading screens. It's usually not this long. How much a numbskull island could it possibly be? Oh, okay, hello. Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm on vacation, but I'm composing some littles just to pass time. Would you like one? Tell me, what clothing does a house wear? Address? Oh, very good. There's no getting past you, young monster. You might just have a future in Pondomancy, young champions. It's so important to sample the lights of this world to let the mind unwind before you're tangled with a new challenge. Okay. Alright, welcome, mates. Are you ready for Numbskull's pirate treasure hunt? Uh, well, we're kind of busy here. Alright, matters not. I'll tell you about it anyway. Nothing personal, buddy. Boss has to walk the plank, so... The infamous scourge of the siege Numbskull hit four of his treasures all over the island. Prove you're not some mangy landlubber and find them all. But Mr. Pirate, your challenge just involves walking around on an island. Don't make me job harder than has to be, yar. <laughs> but worry not, the mighty pirate left clues for scallywags. The first went hiking to the east, the second lives in the north, the third fears the depths of the earth, while the last waits for them on the shore. Come back to me once you found the walls, Abby. 
Uh, are we stuck until we found them? The only ones stuck here is me. Or <laughs> got rent to pay? Yo. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so it's Laura Ling, yeah. I don't say Laura's for some reason. It's not right. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, this is it—the furthest race of the unknown world. Be wary and quick on your feet, intrepid adventurers. As surely danger looks around every corner. It's the perfect place to get some photos for the cover of my next book. What's the setup? The story: the island's lack of beautiful young ladies in distress for me to rescue. I know, I'll get a picture of me rescue myself from dramatic near-death moments. I just need some vines to swing from, perhaps over the gaping maw of a hungry shark. <laughs> you guys know how to make quicksand. Everyone loves quicksand. Adventure is an adventure unless you have pictures to show people afterwards. Yeah. Smish, 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 smish. one. How's your chest? It's full of gold. Oh, never mind. It's plain to plastic. <laughs> All right, one out of four. Why are some of these break cool and others not? Don't oh, have me, game. Shit. Mmm. <laughs> I almost just choked on that. That was sweet. <laughs> almost. Being the keyword. Excuse me, weird coconut man. No! <laughs> Salamander. Over this way. Turtle! Give me a turtle! I will accept my pets. Accept my pets! Yes! <laughs> Alright. Oh, the dub safe one. Let me use this real quick. Okay. Smoosh, smoosh. No, I don't like it when they fall in the water. I can't get those. The hell? Oh, oh. there's a multiple. Oh, this led to another area. Or it just teleported me, I'm not sure. I do love that vandalism, vandalism has remained a core mechanic throughout the entire game. <laughs> it's actually quite necessary in some cases. Super ladle. Four damage. Too powerful. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, a real chest here. Let's find the Berserk Boon. Okay, not to worry about that. Uh, that seems to be it for this area. Just a little chest, that's it. Okay. Slowly getting a... Uh... to max level here. There's only two skill points left after this, so... Oh, no. Wait. I'll see the screen again. It wasn't... You can't see it, but it was there, because it was selecting shit for me. Uh, let's look at the last two skills. Hmm. Mass sleep. 
It's a little more annoying than music that you hate. Alfie follows through on her feet fret and subjects an enemy to cheesy country music. <laughs> Alfie shreds, assaulting an enemy with a cacophony of fast, harsh notes. The listener has to take a few moments to check for hearing loss. Ugh, coconut! Coconut! Ugh. Get away from me! What kind of platform are they expecting me to do over there? Oh shit, I didn't actually make the jump. What's this? Oh, I'll take that. Okay. Some graves here. Nice. Okay. Hey, Salamander. Boop. Oh, it's a loaf palette. Oh, it's like a black outfit. Oh, nice. Oh, God, he's all burnt. <laughs> Perfect. Can I jump back? Here again. I'll save you some time. Oh, this will got kids to kill him. <laughs> oh no, never mind. But it's a few leaf flop. Mm. Oh, we're. Oh no. Are those pesky aliens that me again? Wish me away to a strange new world in the night? Over there, I've seen you before. What is this strange alien planet? Everywhere I look is all ocean, I can't swim. Local all speak some confounded alien tongue. It's impossible to understand them. I'm gonna be trapped on an alien planet, I suppose it could be worse. Maybe I'll stay a while. <laughs> it's an Alfie palette. Mm. Oh, yeah. I'm digging these, like, monochromatic outfits. So, what? How am I supposed to officially get these? I got the last one by cheesing it through the wall, but how do you... Oh, there's a hole on top. I didn't even see that. Ugh. Okay. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah. Let me in. There we go. How do I get out? Oh, okay. Maybe that's how you get the other one. I just kind of said fuck you and just caught it through the wall. <laughs> Probably. Anyways, There's a max level in this game. I had no idea what it'd be. He approaches a simple crow of plain speech. He introduces himself as Sam and quickly starts to share his life story with you. You see, Mr. Loaf, I've been on this long journey with my melon, begins Sam, traveling to this island and climbing all the way up to this mountain. And now our journey's finished, and me and my melon must go both our ways. Both go our ways. Sam's cheerful expression slowly turns into a frown. But what do I do, whispers Sam. Not leave him, alone on top of a mountain, and go home, or go on? But what if he gets devoured by an eagle? Oh, me dear melon. After a moment of silence, you propose to take care of Sam's melon. The crow's face suddenly lights up with joy. Oh, Mr. Loaf, I knew there was some good in the world, Sam rejoices. He then carefully hands you the fruit. Don't you leave that melon, Mr. Loaf, he solemnly explains. You must make me that promise. 
What? <laughs> Is that a castaway reference? You made a promise to the crow. I promise. Don't you leave that bell in, Mr. Lope. And you don't mean to. Wait. What? <laughs> Is it a weapon? What? what a... I didn't see it actually get added to anything. It is a weapon. <laughs> okay, I guess I'll equip that. Jesus Christmas. It does a lot of damage. It also takes a massive amount of space. Alright. Let me just adjust myself. Okay, let's go ahead and I'll end the episode here. I'll readjust off screen and be back. So, thank you all for watching. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Goodbye.